Now, if you're flying over water and you're close to the water or anything like that, then it's almost impossible to not get a little bit of water on your drone. But even if your drone falls completely into the water and it's soaked, I found a way to recover it and it works about 90% of the time. Because really, you're not going to get 100% every time because it might have permanently destroyed something which is probably the most important, is you want to make sure what type of water you're in. There's two types of water. You have your fresh water and salt water. And salt water is going to be the worst of the two. Now, as soon as you can, try to rinse off with fresh water all of the salt water on your drone. Now that will make it so that you won't have any salt buildup. Once you do that, you just want to let your drone sit. You've probably heard this by sticking your phone or something in rice. Do not do this. This is the exact opposite thing that you want to do. It will put dust inside of your electronics and rice might also get inside of your electronics. You definitely do not want that. You're going to want to get a can of air and spray out your whole drone, make sure that it's dry. Go over it with like a paper towel or a rag. And once you do that, then you're going to let it sit. Now, once you let it sit out for about 24 hours, it should be fine and it should power up. If you still think there's water inside of it, then you're going to want to take an oxygen absorber packet. And these are usually made for food. You're going to want to take one of these and take your drone and put it inside of a sealable bag. And you're going to let this sit for about two days. Now after that, all the moisture should be gone and your drone should be back to normal. And if it doesn't power back up, then either wait a little bit longer or your drone's destroyed. Now I've dropped my drone in the water a few times and I've always been able to recover it every time by just doing these things and that includes snow, water, anything like that. Now I hope your drone turns on and you get it recovered. Hopefully these should help you out and this can almost work for any other electronic. Well, I'm Zane Shaw and keep flying.